With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Okay, so the given question here we have is if sec a equals what minus of 17 by 8 and a lies in the second quadrant. Okay, then find the remaining trigonometric ratios given to me in the question. Okay, so first of all, this is my solution section here. If I draw them on the uh, coordinate here, just look here carefully. This is my coordinate here. It says that as you know here that these are the values if I have to arrange them. This is what 0 to pi by 2. Right, this is what 0 to pi by 2 as we can see 0 to 90 degree we are having my first quadrant. This is my first quadrant. From 90 to 180 or we can say pi by 2 to pi. This is having about my second quadrant. Right, you guys know it very well. And from this one, this pi to uh, 3 pi by 2. Okay, or we can say this is what my 270 degree. This is we are having third quadrant. And this one is having from 3 pi by 2 or 272 what? 2 pi. This is what my fourth quadrant. And you guys also know one thing which is most important among them. In this first quadrant, all angles are positive. Just remember this, all angles are positive in this one. In second quadrant, only sine and my cosec are positive. In third quadrant, only what? Tan and cot are positive. So I can write here that tan and cot are positive. And in the last one, which are only having cos and sec are positive. Okay, so these are the all the values here we are having. It says in the question if the sec a value is given to me and a lies in which quadrant? Okay, so let me highlight it here. A is basically lying in the second quadrant. Okay, a is lying in second quadrant. So now if I have to find the value of sec a first of all, sec a is given to me. Sorry, this is a given value, not we have to find something. Sec is what? Minus 17 by 8. Now we know that sec is having the value of minus 17 by 8. Can I find the value of cos a? Exactly. Because we know that cos a is what? A reciprocal of sec a. So 1 upon sec a. Also I can write here 1 upon minus of 17 by 8. Right. No confusion till it. Now moving this forward. I can see that the value of cos a we are going to receive is what? Reciprocal of this sec a. This will be minus of 8 by 17. Why this is a minus sign here? If you guys notice one thing. A is what lying in the second quadrant and in second quadrant cos is negative here. So that's why there is a negative sign in the term here. Cos is what minus of 18 by 17. Now moving further, if I have to find the value of what? Okay, so first of all I know that there is an identity which says that 1 plus tan square a. 1 plus tan square a should be equal to what sec square a. So 1 plus tan square a should be equal to my sec square a. Okay, so what is the value of tan a? Or we know the value of sec a. Okay, so we know the value of sec a minus of 17 by 8. So I can write here 1 plus tan square a should be equals to minus of 17 by 8 whole square. Okay, so now this value will become what? So tan square a value will be what? Tan square a value will be my 17 square will be what? 289. Positive wise this is square and 8 is what? 64. And this is what? Minus of 1 here I have. So this will become 289 uh, taking 64 LCM. This value we are going to receive is what? We are going to receive the value of this one 289 minus 64 by 64 which is equals to what? Tan square a and this value comes out as what 225 by 64 what is the value of 225 uh, this is the square of 15 so I can say here and this is the square of 8 so my tan a value will be what 15 by 8 this is a positive negative value now if I go to the top quotient says that a lies in the second quadrant in second quadrant 10 is negative only sine and cosine are positive so this will become what negative of minus of 15 by 8 okay this is the value of tan a now if I have to find the value of what cot a as we know cot a inverse of what or sorry reciprocal of 1 by tan a so this is what 1 upon the value of is minus 15 by 8 so from this we are going to receive the value of cot a as what minus of 8 by 15 by negative because in second quadrant cot is also negative right now after this what I can do I can find the value of what sine and cosec these are the values we are left with so I can see that first of all what is the value of sine square a plus cos square a I know the entity says that sine square a plus of what cos square a is what 1 so from this we know the value of what do we know the value of cos a now if I go to the top yes cos a is what minus of 8 by 17 so this will become what sin square a minus of 8 by 17 will be what minus plus minus of 8 by 17 whole square right because there is a square a so this will be square equals what 1 so from this sin square a value will be sin square a value will be what 1 minus this is square 64 right and 17 square is what 289 we know it so 289 now taking LCM, this section will become 289 minus 64 will be what? Exactly, we know 225. So 225 divided by 289. This is the square of what? Uh, 15. This is the square of 17. So sine A value we are going to receive. My sine A value is basically what? 15 by 17. Negative positive. It says that it lies in the second quadrant. And in second quadrant, sine and cosec are positive. So this is a positive value. So first value we are receiving is positive, right? And also, if I notice the value of cosec A, cos a k is what inverse of 1 upon sin a sorry reciprocal of this one so this will become 1 upon 15 by 
17 which is coming out as what 17 by 15 reciprocal of this one and also positive because in a only sine and cosec are positive so the values are what cosec a having the value of 17 by 15 sine is having the value of what 15 by 17 now other angles are what tan a is what minus 15 by 8 cot a is what minus 18 by 15 sorry minus 8 by 15 and this one uh, cos a is what minus of 8 by 17 and sec a value is already given to me in the question which is minus of 17 by 8 so these are all the angles we are looking for according to the question here we have for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today